Today's Serial Killers documentary is from the Punjab province of Pakistan. This documentary is about a young man, living in Sialko district of Punjab. The brutal serial killer robbed and murdered 25 ladies. Mohammed Yousuf, the Pakistani serial killer lured the women, showing himself as government official. Pakistani police arrested Mohammed Yousaf on 21st September. 2010, from Pakagaha area, of Sialkot, when he was taking along an old woman with him on motorbike. Unmarried and mechanical engineering diploma holder serial killer, Muhammad Yousuf, used to kidnap old and single women by offering them help in getting some financial support from different government projects, announced for the poor people to get some relief, like Benazir Income Support Program is one of them. Later on he used to kill the women with the help of some blunt tools and bricks or strangulate. Addressing a press conference in his office on Wednesday, DPO Bail Sadiq Kamiana said that Muhammad Yousaf, son of Muhammad Sharif, was arrested near Pakagaha in the Morado police limits on Tuesday when he was taking an old woman on his motorcycle to kill her. He claimed that due He claimed that during last three and a half months, Yousaf had killed a Manabibi of Narawal, Salim Abibi of Adlagaha village, Salim Abibi of Kamanala village, Salim Akta of Mohana Mubarakura, Razul Bibi of Babrianwala village, Amana Bibi and Kurshid Begum of Pakagaha village, Razia Begum of Mujahid Road and Roshan Bibi of Kotli Loharan village. He added that three other women killed by the accused were not identified. The DPO said that Kershida Bibi of Christian Town was badly injured by the accused and being treated in a hospital. He said that the accused had also targeted Asmad Bibi, Subran Bibi, Rashida Bibi and Nazir Begum who survived luckily. DPO Bail Sadiq Kamiana said that the accused used to pick old and poor women on the pretext of providing them financial support through Zakat Fund or Benazir Income Support Program, took them to remote and deserted areas on his motorcycle and later killed them with bricks, stones, blunt weapons or strangled them to death. The DPO said that all the murdered women were between 65 and 75 years. He said that the accused basically was a resident of Gujranwala's Rana colony, but he was living in a rented house at Adlagaha village near Sialkot city. He stated that the accused, still a single, was mentally sound. He added that after a number of blind murders of aged women, policemen in civvies were deployed at general bus stand and other areas. In addition, information provided by an injured woman also helped the arrest of the accused, he said. The DPO said that cases against the accused were registered at Kant, Kotli, Ugoki, Moraba, Morta and Sialkot Saj police stations. The blind murders of so many women during the last few months had caused panic and fear among citizens. Yousaf, the serial killer, told re journalists that he was a cancer patient and wanted to get money for his treatment by looting and killing old women. The Pakistani court sentenced the serial killer of women, Muhammad Yousuf, sentenced to death, life imprisonment and fine. District and Session Judge Sialkot Manzor Hussein Dogar awarded death sentence, life imprisonment and 7 lakh rupee fine to serial killer Muhammad Yousuf in June 2011. Kindly don't forget to subscribe our channel for more crime investigations and serial killer documentaries fro across the globe. Thank you for watching this video.